Dear students, welcome back to our channel. Today we will discuss how to find particular integral when q is equal to x into v where v is any function of x. In the chapter linear differential equations with constant coefficients. The linear differential equations are in the form of f of d into y equal to q. As we all know, just I remind you once again. Linear differential equations are in the form of f of d into y is equal to q. General solution for this type of equations is y equal to yc plus yp. In the last classes, we have learned how to find out complementary function. And now we are finding in these uh, last two classes, how to find particular integral in different cases. In the last class, we have discussed when q is equal to e power ax into v. How to find particular integral when q is equal to e power ax into v. In today's session, we learn how to find out particular integral when q is equal to x into v where v is any function of x. The formula here is particular integral is equal to 1 by f of d into xv x into 1 by f of d into v plus minus f dash d by f of d whole square into v. This is nothing but derivative of 1 by f of d. 1 by f of d derivative with respect to d is minus f dash d by f of d whole square plus into minus minus. So this is the formula for the for, for finding the particular integral when q is equal to x into v. Now we shall see some problems. First problem is solve d square y by dx square minus 2 into dy by dx plus y equal to x into sin x. This is the given differential equation. d by dx we replaced by capital D and d square by dx square is replaced by capital D square. This is d square y, this is minus 2 dy plus y taking y as common d square minus 2d plus 1 into y equal to x sin x. This is the given differential equation. Auxiliary equation is m square minus 2m plus 1 equal to 0. This is a minus b whole square and minus 1 whole square equal to 0. Therefore, we got two equal roots m is equal to 1 comma 1. Complementary function yc equal to c1 plus c2x into e power x. This is the complementary function. Now we find particular integral yp is equal to 1 by f of d into q. In this problem, f of d is d square minus 2d plus 1 and q is x into sin x. We write this d square minus 2d plus 1 as a d minus 1 whole square into x into sin x. This is v, x into v. The formula here is x into 1 by f of d into v plus minus f dash d by f of d whole square into v. This is the formula. x into 1 by d minus 1 whole square into v. In this problem v is a sin x. Plus this is nothing but derivative of 1 by f of d. 1 by d minus 1 whole square derivative is minus 2 by d minus 1 whole cube v is a sin x. Now we expand a minus b whole square and a minus b whole cube. x into 1 by d square minus 2d plus 1 into sin x minus 2 by d cube minus 3d square plus 3d minus 1 a minus b whole cube into sin x. According to the procedure in case of sin x, we have to replace d square by minus a square. d square is replaced by minus 1 square. a is 1 in both the cases. So d square is replaced by minus 1. x into 1 by minus 1 minus 2d plus 1 into sin x. Minus 2 by, we write this d cube as a d square into d minus 3d square plus 3d minus 1 into sin x. Cancel plus 1 and minus 1. x by minus 2, 1 by d sin x. Minus 2 by, replace d square by minus 1. Minus 1 into d, minus 3 into minus 1, 
plus 3d minus 1 into sin x x by minus 2 minus x by 2 1 by d is nothing but integral with respect to x integral integrating sin x with respect to x minus 2 by minus d plus 3 plus 3d minus 1 into sin x minus x by 2 integral of sin x is minus cos x so here the procedure is over minus 2 by 3d minus d 2d 3 minus 1 plus 2 sin x so this is equal to plus x by 2 cos x minus 2 by 2 common d plus 1 into sin x cancel now rationalizing the denominator x by 2 cos x minus 1 by d plus 1 into d minus 1 by d minus 1 into sin x x by 2 cos x minus d minus 1 by a plus b into a minus b a square minus b square into sin x here also we replace d square by minus a square a, a is 1 no? so therefore d square is replaced by minus 1 x by 2 cos x minus d square is replaced by minus 1 derivative of sin x is cos x minus 1 into sin x sin x so yp equal to x by 2 cos x plus 1 by 2 cos x minus sin x this is the particular integral therefore complete solution y is equal to yc plus yp y is equal to complementary function c1 plus c2x into e power x just now we found out yp x by 2 cos x plus 1 by 2 into cos x minus sin x this is the complete solution now we shall see one more problem solve d square minus 2d plus 1 into y equal to x into e power x into sin x this is the given differential equation auxiliary equation is m square minus 2m plus 1 equal to 0 m minus 1 whole square in the last problem we have seen it has a two equal roots 1 comma 1 therefore complementary function yc is equal to c1 plus c2x into e power x this is yc now coming to the particular integral yp is equal to 1 by f of d into q 1 by in this problem f of d is d square minus 2d plus 1 into q in this problem q is x into e power x into sin x now we write this d square minus 2d plus 1 as a d minus 1 whole square into x into e power x into sin x we have three x functions in q we have three x functions first we bring e power ax outside this operator during this step we have to replace a d by d plus a here a is 1 so therefore d is replaced by d plus 1 1 by d plus 1 minus 1 whole square into x into sin x so when we bring out e power ax outside this operator we have to replace a d by d plus 1 cancel plus 1 and minus 1 e power x into 1 by d square x into sin x now this is in the form of a 1 by f of d into x v this is v now we proceed the same procedure x into 1 by f of d into v minus f dash d by f of d whole square 1 by d square derivative is a minus 2 by d cube 
into v. Here v is sin x. Now we replace d square by minus a square. d square is replaced by minus 1. Here a is 1. So here also a is 1. e power x into x 1 by minus 1 into sin x minus 2 by we write this d cube as a d square into d into sin x e power x into minus x sin x minus 2 by replace d square by minus 1 into d sin x so e power x into minus x sin x plus 2 by d we write uh, 1 by d of sin x so e power x into minus x sin x plus 2 replace this 1 by d integral integrating with respect to x 1 by d means integrating with respect to x so this is the yp we are getting now yp is equal to e power x into minus x sin x minus 2 cos x integral of sin x is minus cos x so minus cos x into plus 2 minus 2 cos x this is the particular integral now we find out complete solution y is equal to yc plus yp y is equal to complementary function yc is c1 plus c2x into e power x just now we got uh, yp e power x into minus x sin x minus 2 cos x we can take minus as common so therefore complete solution we write it as y equal to c1 plus c2x into e power x minus e power x into x sin x plus 2 cos x this is the complete solution this is the general solution these problems are very important for bs students and also those students who are preparing for jl dl net and set and also the, also who are preparing for entrance exams these problems help them very much hope you understood thank you